Okay. Please give a very, very warm welcome to Baragi and Jimmy. Hello. Hello. Welcome, ladies and gentlewomen. <laughs> this. Whatever this is. Right. I'm Bragi, this is my friend Jimmy. And today we're going to be playing you a couple of songs just to teach you a little bit about life and the world we live in. <laughs> so I'm going to start off by playing you a little song just to show you what me and Jimmy are about and to show you what you can expect from us. I'm gonna play a song with the only three chords that I know. I'm gonna play them all over again. I'm gonna play a song with the only three chords that I know. And you're gonna hear them all over again. Na na Come along, sing with me. I'm gonna play a song with the only three chords that I know. I'm gonna play them all over again. I'm gonna play a song with the only three chords that I know. <laughs> and it wasn't, well, sort of, depends how you define a first time. Um, let's say I was losing the second half of my virginity. <laughs> Sorry, that could be a page ghost. Um, oh, oh, yeah, I don't know where that is. If anyone has seen that, please tell me. <laughs> Okay, so, um, when I was upstairs in this bed making love, my friend James walks in, picks up a guitar that was in the room, and decides to play me a little song. <laughs> now, I can't remember how that song went, so uh, here's another one. <laughs> a song about, inspired by the relationships we form as people, particularly the ones we form, we form in our youth, so... I like the way I look when I close my eyes. I like the way I smell when I wear perfume. I like the way I sound when I turn my music up. I like the way we shout when I've had a lot to drink. <laughs> I like the way you look when I close my eyes. <laughs> I like the way you smell when you've smoked a lot of weed. <laughs> I like the way you sound when I know you are asleep. <laughs> I like the way you touch me. <laughs> After you've washed your hands. 
told us that our assignment for this weekend was to write a poem. So I went away to my little desk and I wrote a poem about a mermaid, because why the fuck not? <laughs> and this, this, this mermaid in this poem was a mermaid who was a best friend, a wise old woman of the ocean, a mermaid whose eyes could not see, but had seen all the good and the evil the world had to offer. A woman who would defend you, and could defend you. The sharpness of her tongue and the strength in her arms. So I took this poem to Baldy Red-Faced Buckwhip, <laughs> who said he liked the poem, but that it didn't rhyme very well, and he was going to change some of the words, help it flow better, and to help the rhyme. So I walked back to my desk, with a completely different poem altogether. Uh, the mermaid was no longer blind, but she was blonde. So, uh, there was no mention of her wisdom, but there was a mention of her youthful features. I remember no other line from that poem except for youthful features. Yeah, because who doesn't like those? And the strength in her, strength in her arms seemed to be better suited as the sweetness of her smile. So, my mother came the next day to pick me up, and she sat in this room filled with loads of other moms and dads, all sat there to listen to the poems of their children. What joy! So, I stood up in front of this entire crowd of mothers and fathers, and I started crying because I did not want to read out this poem that was written by Baldy Red-Faced Buckwhip. <laughs> so, Baldy Red-Faced Buckwhip read out the poem. Why not? It was his poem. <laughs> <laughs> On the drive home, this very special moment in my life. So that was the day when I became a feminist. <laughs> <laughs> So much, you're all very beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna finish today by playing you one more song because, well, I'm here. <laughs> and this is a song about, well, you can decide what, what it's about, I can't do everything for you. <laughs> I'll defend you. I have nothing left to give Until the mountains fall And there is nothing left to defend I'll stand with you My body will be your shield We'll stand together And if you fall, I'll hold your hand I'll be your light When darkness comes when you are lost, I'll be there to carry you home. There is no me, if there is no you. Stand together and hold on until the end. We've come so far, would be wrong to let go now. We're together, there is no need to be afraid. There is nothing I would not do to keep you up. And 
if you fall down, then I'll just fall down with you. I'll be your light when darkness comes. When you are lost, I'll be there to carry you home. There is no me if there is no you. We'll stand together and hold on until the end. We'll stand together and hold on until the end. And that's the end. <laughs>